Hey everybody, Sharon here from GimmeAct.com. Here we are today in Caterpillar going for every single achievement. Now, getting all of the achievements in this game requires us to get to level 10. As soon as you start up the game, you should be given the first one for starting level 1 for 100 gamer score. This is going to be how the game works. Basically, you control this caterpillar right here. You cannot jump, however, you can climb on walls. So make sure you hug this wall and climb up. The controls are going to be a little different whenever you are on a wall though as your movement is going to be in relation to the wall so holding right is going to move up this wall for example. Nonetheless your goal for every level is to basically try to eat all of the plants and after eating all the plants the goal of the level should open up allowing you to move on to the next level. You should be given an achievement for starting every single level for 100 gamer score apiece. So there's going to be 10 levels we need to start 100 gamer score each for 1000 gamer score total. Once we get to level 2, we're going to drop down the left side right here and staircase our way down, grab those plants. Then we're going to wall climb up here and then get this next plant. And then we're going to keep wall climbing up and then we're just going to keep dropping down. The main platforming in this game is going to be done by dropping down from a higher platform and then onto a lower platform. So make sure you do so and then make sure you get the plants on this bottom one and then hit up the goal. That should wrap up level 2. Level 3 should give us the next achievement for our 100 gamer score. We're going to be introduced to enemies in this level in the form of these three bees. They aren't going to hurt you as long as you jump on top of them. So make sure you use them to platform your way over the body of water. Grab the one and only plant here and then drop down into the next goal to get to the next level and your next achievement for another 100 gamer score. As we get further into the game, the levels are going to require some more puzzle-like thinking. So for this one, we're going to start out by going to the left and grabbing these two plants. Bounce off of that bee to grab this one in the middle. Drop down on the right to grab this one and then the two on this long straightaway. Then we're going to wall climb up here and then grab this one. As you can see, there's going to be a bee here that's going to be a little hard to get at. So we're going to try to drop down on this L-shaped platform. We're going to climb up, sneaking behind the bee. Once we are up top, we're going to use the B to get across this gap and then secure the plant up here. And that should basically allow us to finish up the level. We can drop down here and then wall climb up or we can take the lower path if we really want to. You shouldn't get really stuck because of your wall climb. So just drop all the way down, grab the two on the bottom left to open up this gate. You can also grab these mushrooms, which should give you a speed boost, although they're not going to be super useful at this point of the game. But just use them to speed on to the next level and your next achievement. Once we are at this level, we're going to be introduced to logs. Logs are basically going to work like bees, but over water. So you can jump on them to get a nice little platform. Each log is going to only have one use each, though. So just make sure you use the three logs to get across this body of water. Make sure you grab the plant in this corner. Then we're going to walk climb up. As soon as we are at the apex of the right edge of the screen, drop down onto this L-shaped block, grab the two plants over here, and then use the bridge of bees to get across over to the right, grab the two plants, and then just drop down this chute to move on to the exit and the next achievement, also for 100 gamer score. So there it is, and now we are on level number six. We're going to start out here on this floating island. Make sure you drop down, grab the two plants right here. Super duper easy to get. You have this line in the middle of the screen here. Don't worry about that quite just yet. Instead, what you want to do is you want to make sure you drop down and then grab these two plants right here. So once you have those, we can drop down one more time to get the one in the bottom left. Then onto that line. The way this line is going to work is it's basically going to be a portal. You drop in from the gem side and then warp to the open side. So make sure you climb all the way up on the left edge of the screen, drop into the gem and then teleport to the right side, grab that one plant and then drop down to grab the two plants. And that should take you to the exit and your next level and achievement. Another 100 gamer score right here. Once you have that one, it's time to move on to level number seven. We are dealing with two teleporters this time. We're gonna start out up top, drop straight down in the middle to grab that one plant. Then you're going to want to drop to this teleporter to grab this plant. Then we're going to climb up the right edge of the screen. Then we're going to drop down into this U-shaped block right here. Drop down and grab the right side, then the one in the middle, and then the one on the left. That should take care of the U. Then we're going to hit up the next teleporter and then punch our way across and then grab this last plant and then drop down on the left side to hit up the exit, which should take us to the next level and our next achievements. So this level is going to reintroduce us to the mushrooms. You can use these bottom two to speed you to the left side of the screen. Make sure you wall climb up. 
You can quickly turn around and then quickly grab this plant before getting back onto the wall, but make sure you get back onto that leftmost wall and then take this all the way to the top and then make sure you drop down and then grab this plant right here in this corner. Then make sure you climb up here, use the mushroom speed boost to get you across this gap and then make sure you use the second one to grab that plant. Grab the two plants on the right side right here and then we're going to have to take the B bridge across. So make sure you time it right and then just make sure you bounce your way up here to grab this plant. Then you're going to have to time a gap right here. So make sure you drop down, grab this plant. That should open up the gate, but it should also destroy the bridge up top. So we're going to have to find an alternate way to get across. Thankfully, the B bridge is going to be infinitely spawning. So just make sure you let that restore itself. And then we're going to take the bees across. You have a little pit stop in the form of this center platform right here. So make sure you take advantage of that if you must, but just get across safely. And then you can just wall climb your way to the exit. And then we should be good for this level. And then once we start up level nine, we should be good for the pen ultimate achievement. So there it is. This one's going to be for another 100 gamer score. This one is going to be the last level we need to beat for achievements. So we're going to start out on the bottom right, climb the right side wall, drop down, grab this plant. Then we're going to climb the right side of the middle pond right here. Once we are up here, we're going to cross the bridge. We're going all the way to the exit of the level. Even though it's locked, we can grab the plant right next to it. Then we can climb the left side wall. Make sure you try to get up as high as you can and then drop down to grab this plant on this inverted L. Then make sure you jump across the gap, catch yourself on this wall, and then climb straight up to grab this one. Then make sure you jump across the B and then grab this one. Same for this one. Jump across, grab the last plant to open up the gate and get the bridge down. Then we're going to have to take the logs across to so make sure you do that. Bounce your way all the way back to the exit and then we should wrap it up for the last level we need for all of the achievements. So here we are starting level 10. There's the last achievement, 100 gamer score. That should be all 10 achievements, 1000 gamer score total and the completion. And that's all there is to it.